Hello everyone, this is Ghazal Sultani from Jobs Innovation Limited. I am going to present our research result on noise reduction effect by damper on single rail. First, I am going to talk about rolling noise, two mass damper, and rail vibration frequency. However, railway transportation is one of the greenest transportation, but still there is a problem, noise. Rolling noise is one of the major source of the noise, which is associated with the vibration of the rail at frequency range between 400 to 1500 Hz. But this is not the end of a story. There is another story, ground bone noise. In another paper from our research team, we will present about ground bone noise. Now the question is, how to reduce the noise? One of the best solutions for reduction of the noise is toned mass damper, TMD. They can absorb the energy of the rail with 90 degree phase lag in order to provide maximum damping. The energy is dissipated by the hysteresis from resilient layer. In addition to the amplified hysteresis process at tuned frequency, it also provides with scholastic damping for high frequency. In this project, reduction requirement is 4 dBA. Then we need to know which frequency should be tuned our damper, which rail should we install our damper on. Both rails, only high rail, or only low rail. We found out that each rail has different frequency. In general, there are different vibration frequency in high and low rail. In this side, high rail has a broadband peak at 300 to 600 Hz with a vibration level equal to 110 dB. And low rail has a peak at 500 Hz with a vibration level equal to 120 dB. A TMD rail damper tunable for individual side has been developed in Hong Kong since 2008 with a patented technique to control high frequency. The new generation of TMD is modular TMD. Each module consists of two mounting plates and four oscillators. Due to their small size, they allow up to three damper in installation between two fastener spacing. You can see here single, double, and triple in installation. An installation of free damper module occupies the same space similar to previous damper used in 2017. Now I'm going to talk about measurement method and TMD frequency selection. We mentioned that the project noise reduction requirement is 4 dBA. In this side, high rail has a broadband peak at 300 to 600 Hz with a vibration level equal to 110 dB. And low rail has a peak at 500 Hz with a vibration level equal to 120 dB. Then we decide to install our damper first with low rail. We install our damper on low rail in an alternative spacing, which we call half installation. Then we fill the empty space and change it to single installation. We observe that we can achieve 4 dBA noise reduction by installation of our damper only on low rail. However, for another reason, we install on high rail in every four spacing, which we call quarter installation. Wherever our measurement locations, our measurement has been done on the web lateral, foot tip, vertical, and on the rail. We also installed our mics in saloon and the tunnel. How we schedule our measurement and installation is shown in a table. Before any damper installation, 
we measure the noise of vibration a second and a fourth month after first grinding cycle. Here is presented the noise and vibration at high rail and low rail without any damper installation. A second month and a fourth month after first grinding cycle. The vertical line is a weighted noise and vibration level and the horizontal line is a frequency at one third octave band. You can see here our measurement data at saloon noise, vibration, and tunnel noise. This graph is from our paper. I know it is too much data, but the main focus of this slide is to show that the vibration in high rate is 10 dB lower than low rate. For better observing the noise and vibration during the time, at next slide, I'm going to present some important lines. Important lines from this graph about the saloon noise, vibration level, a second month, and fourth month after first grinding cycle. The noise and vibration without damper installation for high rate are shown in the left and for low ray at the right side. The lateral vibration at second and fourth are shown. Vibration level for second and a fourth month at high ray are very close below 2000 Hz. However, at low ray, the difference are 6.5 dB at 500 Hz. Now let's discuss about vertical vibration. Again, for high rail, the difference for below 2000 Hz is very negligible. At 500 Hz, 1 dB difference can be seen, while the difference for low rail is, four, is 5 dB. It shows that the vibration level during the time will increase largely at low rail, but with a small difference in high rail. The higher vibration level at low rail is due to corrugation at low rail. Now let's talk about saloon noise. You can see from the graph, fourth month is slightly more than second month, so the noise level will increase during the time. The increase at 500 Hz is 1.3 dB while at 1000 is 2.3 dB. We note that level increase at 1000 Hz is due to the increase in vibration level at low rate. At 1000 Hz vibration level at low rate will be increased 4.5 dB. Now for better understanding, I will present the same data comparing between vibration level at high rail and low rail in vertical lateral direction, a second month after first grinding cycle. The vibration level without damper installation at vertical direction for second month after first grinding cycle is shown at the left, while the vibration at lateral direction is shown at the right. You can see here that low rail is 6 dB higher than high rail at vertical and 9 dB higher in lateral at 500 Hz. This shows the higher vibration level at low rail is due to a stick a slip action and corrugation development at low rail. Then we select low rail to show the effect of passing time on vibration level. I'm going to present the vertical and lateral vibration during second month and a fourth month after first grinding cycle. You can see here, 5 dB increase vertical, while 7 dB increase in lateral direction at 500 Hz. The increase of vibration level is due to corrugation growth from second to fourth month. The corrugation growth is suppressed by rail damper. 
such that the vibration is higher with that damper. A result about corrugation growth, published in another paper. Some graph from that paper will be presented later in this presentation. Another measurement that we have done in order to decide the frequency for tuned frequency of our tuned mass damper is point mobility. The vertical axis is mobility, velocity over force, and the lateral is frequency level. We measure mobility in vertical and lateral direction. You can see here two vivid peak at 1030 Hz in vertical and 570 Hz in lateral. But the mobility at lateral direction is much higher than vertical. You can see here 24 dB increase in lateral direction respect to vertical. Then, according to frequency peak at mobility in lateral direction, 550 Hz are selected for our tuning frequency. With this frequency tuning, the damping force is amplified by almost 6 times at 550 Hz. For higher frequency, Vibration, for higher frequency vibration, normal viscoelastic damping will apply, such that the 1000 Hz vibration will be damped similar to direct attachment of rubber material. Now I'm going to talk about noise reduction by damper only on low rate. After second grinding cycle, first, we measure again noise and vibration without any damper installation. Then, we install our damper for the half and single on low rail and one quarter on high rail. And again, we measure the noise and vibration at both rail, both high and low rail, both high and low rail. I will present and compare some important lines about vibration at vertical and lateral for the rail without any damper for half an installation and single installation at next slide. Let's discuss about location A and B first. Location A is the location of the damper in half an installation while location B is the adjacent empty space to the damper. Now the vibration level at vertical and lateral are presented here. We can see here at 500 Hz the vertical vibration at empty location is 7.1 dB while at, the lateral, while at the lateral direction it is 13 dB. Now for vertical vibration at the location of a damper the reduction is 9 for vertical and 17.8 for lateral. What we understood here is, not only at the location of the damper, but also at the empty location, the reduction is significant. This is due to residual effect of the damper at the empty adjacent spacing. Then we install our damper. A single installation, the vertical vibration reduction becomes 12.6 and the lateral vibration reduction becomes 21.5 dB. For better observing the noise and vibration reduction, at different frequency, I will present the reduction graph in the following slide. Now talk about the vertical vibration reduction. For the half installation at location of the B and location of the A, and for single installation are presented here. The reduction at 500 Hz are 7.1 dB at location B and 9 dB at location A. The 7.1 dB reduction at the empty spacing is due to 9 dB damping effect at the adjacent space. Then the additional damper also installed at the empty space to make up a single installation. 12.6 dB reduction is at achieved at every space with damper. For lateral vibration at location B, 
the vibration reduction at 500 hertz is 13 dB. What are the location A is 17.8 dB. With single end installation, the vibration reduction will become 21.5 dB. The noise reduction at Salon at 500 hertz is 4 for half an installation and 4.8 for single end installation on low rail and 5.6 for quarter on high rail. However, the important for us is overall noise reduction, which are 3.3 dBA for half an installation, 4.1 dBA for single end installation, and 0.5 0.8 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 0.9 
The better vibration reduction in second month is the result of the fast vibration increasing rate due to fast corrugation without damper. You may remember the overall salon noise reduction was 3.3 dBA for half installation, 4.1 dBA for single installation, and 5 dBA when one quarter was added to high rate. In this slide, I talk about salon noise level. A few months after damper installation and rate grinding, the overall reduction for salon is 5.7 for second month and 7 for point for fourth month. At the end, I present about another important data of track decay rate. The track decay rate at vertical and lateral direction for without and with TMD are presented here. You can see here the damper increase, the decay rate significantly. Track decay rate at 500 Hz are increased by 3.4 dB over meter at vertical and 2.9 dB over meter at lateral direction. The actual TTR with tune mass damper is much better than at this at the TMD frequency because the current excitation method with hammer does not account the amplified TMD effects, which need a short period of time for development of a damping force. Now we concluded that noise reduction with damper on low rail can achieve 3.3 dBA for half installation, while 4.1 dBA for single installation. Extra noise reduction with damper on high rail can be almost 5 dBA for one quarter in installation. Noise reduction during the time. A second month after third grinding cycle is 5.7 dBA, and a fourth month after third grinding cycle is 7.4 dBA. Then, half an installation of damper can make a rail quiet enough. Thank you all for listening to our presentation.